Hello and namaste. It's Jewel from Goddess Creative. How are you all doing today? It's a bit chilly here in Australia. We're um, going, heading towards our colder weather, our winter time. All you guys over there in the US probably heading towards much warmer weather. Hopefully this gets you getting outside and enjoying some sunshine and um, exploring um, in nature more. Okay, so what I'm coming to you today about is the fund that I've set up. I've decided to collaborate with Harapan Project. It is a project, um, where I talked about the Bali Children's Fund. I've decided to connect with Harapan because it is from Sambawa, Indonesia, and it's the outer islands of Bali. Um, they get less funding and less support so than the, just the island of Bali actually gets a lot of support um, from Aussie es expats and a lot of people that have visited Bali. So these guys miss out a bit because they're on the outer islands. So that's why I wanted to do it and connect with them. And I have spoken to the founder of this Harapan project who's doing a wonderful job. So um, this is my idea here. And if you go on my website, if you go under the – this is my website here. You just go to the home page and it's going to be up the top here, Pay It Forward Crypto Fund, Okay. So this is my idea here. This is me with your generosity because, look, let's face it, I'm not asking you to donate now. Many of you have already donated, okay? Many of you have already donated to me. You're so generous and you're so kind. And it's part of those donations that I'm putting into this fund already. But if you see if you feel see fit that you would you would like to contribute as well, you can do that. You can do that directly um, via Harapan, and I've set up the links underneath. Um, or you can do it through this Pay It Forward Fund here. So yeah, so as I said, yes, the Pay It Forward Fund, and it's because of your generosity that I really want to pay it forward because. I really am a big believer that, you know, wherever attention goes, um, abundance flows and I want to support and uplift and that's what I've been giving out to you guys but also you've been returning it to me so I want it extended out further because I just feel we have, we're just so lucky and we're so blessed and, you um, you know we are really we are in a bull run, and some of you have already made some some great um, profit already. And I know that I have. I mean, my own portfolio, although I haven't cashed out yet, is more more than quadrupled or more 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 than that. So um, I really really want to pay it forward, and so I'm sending some of my own funds, some of the um, beautiful donations that you've given me, I want to pass on to this project. Um, so that's why I've done this. So my plan is um, is to fund is in the, some of the low cap coins that will grow big in the coming months. So I've, if you go to this page, here are the, here they are here. It's Digibyte, Zilliqa, VeChain, Dent, Doge, Tron, and Ada. Right. Um, my plan is to trade a little out into dollars and send it monthly to the charity. Okay. Um, and the charity is, that I've chosen is called the Harapin. Um, and here's the link here, but here it is also here. And I'm going to have the links underneath as well in the underneath this video. I'll do that as well. Um, but you can donate directly if you don't want to go through me. If you don't feel comfortable doing that, that's perfectly fine. Um, but it, at this stage, and I'm 
you know, I have spoken to Carlos about it. At this stage, you can um, donate in. Um, anyway, the links will be underneath. You can donate directly, um, as I said, and you can donate in, I think it's euros or US dollars, I think is what's available, or Indonesian, I think it is. So they're the only options there. Or, um, as I said, I have talking, I've spoken to Carlos. I spoke to him yesterday. Um, I am trying to assist him to add to his website in um, with cryptocurrency um, so people could um, donate in crypto. But that's kind of easier said than done to help somebody that um, – that doesn't really understand crypto um, and you do need to have time to learn this and currently at the moment when I spoke to Carlos yesterday he was and this is Carlos here by the way <laughs> this is Carlos he's lovely he has dedicated his life he used to be a lawyer um, in I think it's Brazil all the information is here all the information is here if you look up a, his about us and about the projects and the story and everything. All the information is all there. They're registered, all that kind of stuff, if you were worried about that. Um, but, um, yeah, he's really lovely. But when I spoke to him yesterday um, uh, by WhatsApp, he was actually in hospital. He was helping. He had a little baby not his baby, but one of the children, one of the little village children he'd taken to hospital that has um, heart, it has a hole in the heart. So, um, and it, this, so he was sort of on call at the hospital helping the family out because the family had never actually been into a hospital before. So he's doing great work there and he has very much dedicated his life to, um, moved out of the, you know, mainstream Western life and, and into really helping going forward and contributing um, whichever way he can to assist these villages. And they really are um, their outer island villages of Bali. So that's where they are um, in Indonesia. So, yeah, so all the information is there. As I said, he's re he is really, really lovely. You can go on here and you can have a look, okay? Um, so hopefully I might be able to get him um, set up with crypto if he's got time, but I think his priority is the children um, and is the families and is really, really um, helping those children and families. And he helps with, as I said, medical, everything to do with medical, for the children and the families in these outer islands. He helps with schooling as well. As well. They're doing, if you look on their website, and also with the housing, very much with the housing. So my idea is to basically help with crypto um, because you guys have been so generous to me, so I want to pay it forward and I want to, you know, give my thanks because I know when – you really open your hearts and you guys really have opened your hearts, so many of you, especially, you know, the people from last year that have been following me. Um, you continue to support me and I really, really appreciate that. I really do. So I also want to support with your help as well. So um, I want to keep giving you good content, but not only that, um, really help people that are less fortunate to, than us that are not in crypto and you know what you know there you see a lot of I like because I've spent a lot of time on Bali a lot of you know the Indonesian and Bali people are so beautiful they've you know they've got very little and they have really big smiles on their faces their children are really happy you know so I just I want to assist where I, where I can, and I just think that this would be a nice way to assist. So that's why I'm doing this, okay? So, yeah, and it is because so many of you have been so kind and generous to me and, don and donated already. So part of those donations I'm paying forward, and I just wanted to give, you know, shout-out and thanks 
to a few people also. Um, Nicole, she just donated um, for an update of my crypto report one, which is not ready yet. It's not ready yet. Haven't done it. Probably will come early April. Um, I just want to get through March. Um, but, um, yeah, part of she's donated well and truly over, you know, just the $10 donation. And so, you know, part of her funds I want to put, pay it forward here. Um so, so that is the same with quite a few of you. I had written down names. There's so many of you that have donated and you know who you are. Rose, you're another one. Um, Anthony is also going to donate. He wants to donate. Um, he wants to donate, which I've got to work out how to do yet. This is Anthony from the USA. He wants to donate uh, my reports to somebody in need. So I was going to run a competition for doing that, but I haven't worked out how to do that yet. But I'll, I'll come back with another video with that one. This is different from what this is here. But part of his funds, obviously, if, some, if he's donating that, I'm going to pay it forward and put into this crypto fund. The reason it's going into crypto, everybody, is to grow the crypto, okay? So I wanted to say thank you to Jimmy, okay, my, my friend Jimmy, okay, because he's already donated to this crypto fund and he donated Digibyte back on the 11th of March. He donated 778 Digibyte, which has grown already. So... Um, and there was also an anonymous donation. I don't have a name. Um, but somebody on the 9th of March, and you'll know who you are, donated 240 zil, right, to my address, this address here, the, the fund address, um, back on the 9th of March. And I want to thank you both very much for being the first supporters to this new fund. And already... Uh, because they donated back on the 9th and the 11th when I first mentioned this, um, already your altcoin has grown in value. So already Digibyte's up today and Zillica's up. Um, so it's really beautiful, really, really beautiful to see. Now, the reason why I've chosen these, I wanted to mention Dent. Lou, Lou from Australia is doing his own um, charity. He's doing the Dent thing. He's doing a charity fund for Dent. So he's put a certain amount of Dent into a charity fund. Um, I didn't realise Dent was so expensive to send, but I've added it here and you may not want to pay in Dent because Dent's actually really expensive to send. But anyway, Lou's doing his own fund and he's uh, donating um, part of it. Um, and he's doing the dent to three million with Ethan, um, and um, the Ethan's idea to the dent to three million, changing dent into V chain and then into Doge. Yep, that's how it goes. Um, and so he's trialing that out, and hopefully he gets close to what we want and then he's going to donate to our selected charity or one of our selected charities. So that's really beautiful. Thank you, Lou from Australia, for you know your intention to do that. That's so beautiful. Um, all right, so yeah, so maybe not donate and dent. I didn't realise dent was so expensive to um, even you know, move or send. I, I, I've learned that just recently. So maybe you don't want to donate Dent. But these other ones, Digibyte, Zillica, VeChain, Doge, I've added Tron because um, it's still very low in price and I do believe it has great potential. That's why these are on here. I know Cardano Ada is not low in price. I've added that one on there. I've added it on there because a lot of people have Cardano. A lot of people have Cardano. I know how popular it is. Um, but um, 
I just don't want you to have to change because when you have to change into another one that perhaps you don't already own, then it's going to be more expensive for you to send. So I don't want you have to have to do that. So that's why I've added Cardano. But also because I believe all of these and all my others in my crypto reports, I'm not doubting that, but I just had a little look in, in these ones today. And so I did want to mention that. Um, that all of these I know are going to have make great potentials going up for June, all right? They're going to have a little spikes is what I'm getting. So I know that Digibyte and particularly Zillicar, I know a lot of you have been a bit disappointed with my Zillicar because I had it much higher, but I am getting that still it may not reach the first quarter price in first quarter, it may go into second quarter before it reaches the first quarter price of a Zelica in my crypto report one. But I am getting really good prices still the same. It's going to have a spike. So I'm thinking, and I don't know if you follow any astrology or anybody who's into astrology, um, there's meant to be really good alignments coming up on the 26th of March. Um, a few of them are saying that. I think it's Joni, Jody, Joni Patry. She does a bit of crypto astrology. And there's a few other people that do crypto astrology. Um, so they're getting spikes. Well, I think Joni mentioned the spike for the 26th of March. So I just checked in with Spirit myself and I get do get this as confirmed. So I'm thinking that there is great potential for a spike up then. So, yeah, I wanted to let you know there. So, yeah, and then also what I did was um, I had a little quick look at Digibyte yesterday and I pulled a card for Digibyte and this is my card. I got the Queen of Cups for Digibyte, which I thought was really, really beautiful, really, really, really beautiful, okay? And so what I get, I get for this card and for Digibyte, I get it moving out of, you can see these, a bit of thunder and a bit of dark clouds. I get it moving out of that. And or and I, I did this yesterday and already today Digibyte has had a spike, right? Had a rise up to what it was yesterday. It's already moved up. So I get it doing very well, um, particularly, it might have a bit of run up on that 26, but I get do get it, yeah, I do get it confirmed. If you have my crypto report one, I did get it confirmed, the price that I have for, for that first quarter, um, and I do get it doubling, doubling, yeah, that price. Um, for soon after so that's what I got um, so yeah I think that's really good so yeah so that's why these I, these are still low these these coins so I think um, and so that's why I've chosen these ones to be ones that really haven't had their huge pops yet but are going to have their huge pops so even that's why even two dollars of any of the bar, the above will end up being a great blessing and to be able to pay it forward um to to this charity the um the harrapin charity so yeah so that's what i was wanting to do there I do think that all these cryptos, that's why I've chosen them, haven't had their true spikes yet, haven't had their runs, and so that's why they have been chosen. So, as I said, even $2 of any of the above will end up a great blessing. So what I'm going to do in conjunction with the starting of this fund and to get it going and so I can start actually sending Carlos some funds so he can help these children and families i'm going to offer a offer for you guys <laughs> um 
which is this. So it's for a limited time only to the 1st of April, okay? So this is, yeah, um, till the end of the month. Uh, send a minimum of $2 in any of the above altcoins and then email me, okay, jewel at goddess creative. Um, that should be .com. By, by the way, I'll put .com in there. The exact amount you sent, you have to tell me the exact amount you sent, otherwise I can't, I don't know that it was your, you have to either give me your sent address that you sent from, and I know some people don't like to do that, so even if you give me the, the last few, like, last few, um, what is it, digits and numbers and things. You don't have to send the whole address. Um, but if you send the last, like the last few digits so I know that it's from you um, and the exact amount you sent, then I know that you sent into the fund because that's the only way I can tell because otherwise it's anonymous, like the beautiful person that sent me the zill is anonymous. I don't know who sent it to me, but um, yeah, otherwise it ends up being anonymous. Um, and if you send me an email telling me um, the altcoin you request me to have a look at, okay? So you have to do this, um, yeah, via, via an email, okay, because you have to give me the, um, I think that's the way to do it. Maybe you could post it underneath in the comments, I guess you could do that. The exact amount what you sent and the exact amount you sent instead of emailing me you could do that i guess that would be fine it's all a learning curve and the mechanics of how this is going to work but yeah um the yeah um i guess if you do it that way then i'm not going to double up if you put it in the comments box below but you have to give me the exact amount you sent in what particular altcoin and maybe the last, you know, five digits, one, two, three, four, five, five digits, five or six digits, uh, numbers or digits of your address you sent from. Not my address because my address is all the same. It needs to be your address you sent from, okay, because then it's individual and unique to you, okay. Because I do get the sent address, but I know you don't want to make it public. I'm trying to, yeah, <laughs> waver through this. Okay. Or if you don't want to do that, then email me. But then you don't have any idea who are, who is requesting what altcoin. So I was just trying to make it so it wasn't doubling up on the same altcoin. Yeah. So, yeah. And then what I'll do is I will do a video that will come probably next week with a thank you to you of what you donated and your altcoin, the information on your altcoin you requested. So how's that? I think that's nice. It's a nice way for me to pay it forward and it's a nice way for you to pay it forward um, because I'm dedicating some of my time to, do, to finding out and doing this. Yeah, okay, that sounds good. Um, all right, I think this is that's all I have today. I hope this finds you well, and um, thank you so much for you know for continuing to support my work. And thank you to the new people. Welcome to the new people. I, I've noticed so many new people, you know, um, have been purchasing my new report. Um, that they, you're completely new to me. I I. I have seen some of you in the comments boxes, uh, comments underneath the videos, but I hadn't, you know, you hadn't come through to actually purchase any of my work before. So it's lovely. Um, thank you for joining us on this amazing crypto ride that we are going to have this year. This is such an exciting time. We are so blessed to be in this. This is the amazing crypto ride and this amazing crypto bull run that we are all on together and I feel so blessed and I'm in appreciation for you and I want to pay it forward and I hope you do too. Okay, namaste, blessings.